Uh, today's training exercise actually went well. Um, our whole goal of this whole exercise was to get the kids locked in the classrooms in case there was somebody in the school that wasn't supposed to be there, um, possibly trying to cause harm or running away from the police at that time. Um, we were the first ones in the school running and it was a good shock value to see teachers because we came in, we came in hard uh, yelling up and saying we want to see our son, we want to see where they were and what they were doing. Um, you could see the kids as soon as they said lockdown that they started running um, towards their classrooms, some were running outside. Um, I caught two kids running inside the school, um, which we, we touched them, we say they're injured and they actually played along with the game which is, was great for them. Um, we did all the hallways, we checked all the doors, banging on the doors, yelling yelling for the, the kid we were looking for. Um, the majority of the doors were all locked. Uh, the one classroom we actually got in was actually open, but no one was in the room, which was excellent. Um, all the teachers all played along, all the students were great. Um, I think they did a very good job today. Now, you normally wouldn't be the first in the school. You would, so how is this exercise going to be useful for you should you be called to an incident like this? You realize how fast it can happen and how time is of the essence to get down there and all the curriculum information that you get right off the bat about who, what, where, when and how and what they look like um, really helps us as police officers when we go to a situation like this. Um, knowing how fast you can actually get into the front door of a school um, and do what you want to do is really quite um, surprising. That there's no one there to stop, there's no locked doors, um, that if you actually just walk in with a firearm, um, you can walk in the doors anywhere you wanted to and do whatever you want. Um, so being a teacher, being vigilant to who's coming in and going out of those schools um, is actually great, uh, keeping them on their toes like that also. Yeah, because that's not experience. You would normally, like you, I mean, you probably would have a sense of that, but wouldn't necessarily know it when the boots are hitting the ground, exactly how fast things can happen. Yes, it's quite surprising how fast things can happen. Even police, police officers, we're on the road, we're kicking cars. We're, we're dealing with other people possibly at the time, so we get a call to come to school like this, um, and you hear that there's a person in a school that's possibly causing problems. Our first response is to get there as fast as we can to protect the children and protect the teachers of what's going on. Uh, to protect life is one of our main things that we want to do. Um, so giving the information that we need as soon as we can from the teachers at the school is a great benefit to us.